Just tackles and uh, yeah, it's had some guys out of place, you know, uh, a little sloppy. It's, it's all things that we can get taken care of, and that's one thing our coaches staff's going to do. You know, we we'll work tackling. You know, we expect to be flawless against LSU next week. Some of Dyer, I mean, you, you seem to get outside a good bit on y'all. What were some of the issues there? Definitely, uh, you know, he's a he's a great back. We, we, you know, we thought he was gonna, you know, run a lot downhill, but uh, you know, we got Fletcher and Josh up in there, and so you know, Auburn's probably not gonna want to run in there with you know probably two of the best you know tackles in the country, you know, from the way I see it. But uh, so they were able to get outside of us a couple of times, and you know, it's just something we got we got to work on and get fixed. But but uh, to give props to Michael Dyer, he's a tremendous back. Hard to bounce back from this. You only got five days. You got to put it behind you immediately. I'm sure. Right. Yeah. That's one thing Coach told us. We really we got to. It hurts. You know. Uh, you know. We'll think about it on the bus ride back. But you know, maybe, maybe it's a good thing for us. Maybe we'll. Uh, we'll you know, I, I'm going to be playing, like, practicing like you know, no other. You know, and I expect everyone else to do that. But uh, we got to put it behind us, and we got LSU rolling in, who's going to be just as good of a team. And uh, hopefully, we'll play with a chip on our shoulder now.